in the air. Catch it is a call. Will go over mid off comfortably. In fact, it'll go to the boundary after a couple of bounces. Good positive start. That's what he's capable of. He'll come out. He'll pick his moment and go for the shots. And it was up. It's not that in control, but weight transfer. Getting on to the front foot, back foot in the air. Managed to transfer enough weight on it. Clear the infield for boundary. Just opens the face. That smart batting. It'll race away hip in the outskirts in this. The boundary area is quite quick. Cross is nicely shaved off. This had timing. Nothing about power. It's almost like a replay from first game. In the length. Angling it. Run probably just pulling back a length ever so slightly and that allowed to pierce that gap. He's a classy player to watch. In the air, but again would clear mid on. It'll go one bounce. Boundary. Good tactics. Attack the opposition. Just rattle them for a bit in the power play. He's not going to hold back. Just a step down, created that length through the line. You could hear that cracking sound coming in. Ashutikbal saw the movement, had to adjust his length, and that exactly allowed to play the shot freely. Something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. He's missed it, and he's gone for four. Imran not happy. Why should he be? He's the bowler. He was in the air for a while. I think the fielder did his best. That's other Farhan there. He rushed it. But really couldn't really manage to get underneath it. It wasn't middle, it was just chipped in. The last moment he thought he's not going to get that catch. Tried to finish. Losing the boundary, but really couldn't do that. This time, opportunity again, and just lands in a waking zone. And one shot too many, probably just get a feeling. He needs to choose the deliveries for those shots. Short one goes for that very half-hearted pull. Yeah, you bowl bad lines, that'll go away. Imagine a better is slim. You're bowling a good over, then just you offer a freebie. got a good hands, the bad speed, standing and helping it on its way. With that field, it was bound to travel to the boundary. Again, a slower one, catch it, it's just over mid-off, and another boundary. Hassan Nawaz looking to finish this off quick, 28 or 14 for him now. Omad and Imran Jr, again the length, that's the issue. It's a free hit for Hassan Nawaz. He'll go after it because there are no fielders. Back of the hand. He had enough wood on it that it traveled to the boundary. Catcher is the call, but again, it just lands. I don't know for a moment. Both the fielders were less, a little confused who's actually going for it. But still, you can't blame the two because it's landed perfectly between the two yeah Mir was back at the boundary probably he could have gone for that aise hook kiya koi fielder nahi hai fine leg boundary par aur gend awaaz se baatein karti hui nikal gayi boundary ke bahar zyada qareeb se woh talent dekh rahe hain aur ye kharab shot khel baithe और ये बदकिस्मती है कि चीफ सेलेक्टर की मौजूदगी में ऐसा शॉट खेल दिया यहाँ हसन नवाज ने हावी होना चाह रहे थे खालिद उस्मान पर जो बड़ी नपी तोली बॉलिंग कर रहे हैं और दूसरी कामयाबी उन्होंने हासिल की और नॉर्दर्न की टीम अब मुश्किल में घिर गई है यहाँ रश ऑफ ब्लड ज़्यादा ज़रूरत नहीं थी इस तरह के एक्सपेंसिव शॉट खेलने की खालिद उस्मान लेफ्ट आर्म स्पिनर को अगर आप अगेंस्ट स्पिन खेलने जाएंगे और ये बहुत स्मार्ट ऑपरेटर हैं इतने आराम से आपसे हिट खाएंगे नहीं अच्छा आगाज मिल गया था 
उसको सिर्फ कंटिन्यू करना था हसन नवाज की जानब से लेकिन अपनी विकेट गवा बैठे जिस अपॉइंटमेंट जरूर रही हुई होगी नॉर्दर्न कैंप में और जैसे आपने कहा जब चीफ सेलेक्टर मौजूद हों तो आपको उनको इम्प्रेस करने के लिए लंबे रन करने होते हैं लेकिन यहाँ पर अपनी विकेट गवा बैठे तिरपन पर तीन नॉर्दर्न